Hello fellow crafters, my name is George and this is the Spare Time G and today we're gonna make the Colossus from the X-Men. Now let's start the sculpting process by making the frame, copper frame from the wire. And the, as the sculpture is not going to be very big, it do not need to be founded into the base of the sculpture. Now I have started adding some clay layers onto the frame to give it a little distinctive look and uh, cover it uh, more with um, extra clay. Here you can see I have made the distinctive shape of legs and muscles on legs, also the boots. And now I have refined all of them, uh, made the knee part, also the upper torso is thick. So this is the hands which I'm going to make Colossus stand in the crossed hand posture like this which he does in the movie. Here is the finished version of the shape of the hands. It has not added, I have not added some muscles yet but uh, right now you can uh, like understand what I'm going uh, with. I have also thickened up the lats portion and also uh, smoothened the uh, trousers and also here you can see the muscled version of the hands which look quite nice to me. I have added the forearms and bicep and tricep parts and now I'm going to make the head which is the most uh, important and the hardest part of uh, our sculpture here. As you can see I have added some rough details of the nose, also the cheeks and eyebrows and I have refined them. It took a lot of time, maybe an hour and hour and a half. It was quite hard but I, I am happy with this result with the strong jaw and the structured face look as the Colossus has. So this is our detailed version as you can see I have added some lines on the arms also on the neck not on the face as he do not has those lines on the face and also I have added some details on the cargo pants he is wearing. And now we're going to paint our sculpture. So this is our finished version as you can see I it looks quite nice. I'm very happy with this metallic look on his hands and his face. The only thing is that for some reason the shading inside those um, cracks became darker. I don't know why. So that was it. You can always go to my Facebook page and see this and other pictures of my this and other projects. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this project as much as I enjoyed making it. If so, please leave a like down below. This is my first episode in the upcoming series which is called Little Giants. If you are interested in sculpturing and model making, please uh, take a look at my other projects. Have a nice day and goodbye. See you next time.